Yeah. Easy uh, enough. Right. It's recording. So, this is the uh, magic user run of Dark Souls. Um, we tried to stream this, and unfortunately it wasn't working. My internet was being horrible. So, we're already here in the creation menu. I've created my character, Sir Reggie Bro, the male sorcerer. I am a horrible player when it comes to magic users. I never play them. Um, I'm always a tank. And so, <laughs> this is going to be very painful for me. But David, say hello, David. Hello, David. There you go. He's going to be a cleric, because <laughs> he also rarely does magic users, but he is more familiar with them than I am. So we decided to do a magic co-op thing. So we're going to switch bosses back and forth and co-op play through the game uh, as magic users, hopefully making it a little easier, but at the same time, it's Dark Souls, and it's a class I suck at, so it'll still be painful. Um, the only thing I have left to do is to finish his face and hair. So I'm going to go with the Dragon Scholar because he's from the Dragon Priest School of Vanaheim or whatever. I'm going to give him... Oh. Crazy hair, maybe? I don't know. The hair really doesn't matter in Dark Souls 1. I forget how much it really doesn't matter. Yeah. I, uh... You know that part when you're going up the stairs to the uh, undead bird How yeah there's the uh part where you gotta jump to get the one item yeah to Com fail completely f completely forgot about uh you know it's not l3 in the first game you can change so it just ran. in remastered you can remap it that's fine i don't mind it being circle it's just yeah that was the last one I had used, was it being the thumbstick. So yep, just ran right off the edge. Alright. Well, I'm sitting through the intro cutscene. Um, it's been a while since I've seen the intro cutscene. Still one of my favorites. It's so good. Which tomorrow, by the way, since I'll be back home, I'll have to show you the Solar Amiibo in person. It's so good. Yes. It's a wonderful Definitely. Amiibo. Because it looks nice in picture form, but it's still only in picture form. It is so detailed. I wish they would do a full line of Dark Souls Amiibos, but they have mm -hmm. to definitely make it easier to get them than the Solaire one was. Like, I barely got this ordered in time. I, like, the day after they announced it, I went to GameStop, because he was, like, a GameStop exclusive, and I ordered it. And Well, I went there with Cody, and while we were there, the guy who worked at the GameStop looked it up for himself, and it was available for pre-order, and I was like, if you can order two, I would like to order it myself, please. So he ordered it for both me and him, and I was very, very happy. But oh, that's good. if they do more of these, they definitely, even if it's a GameStop exclusive, it has to be more readily available, because it's ridiculous how hard some of these Amiibos are to get. Yeah. And just Dark Souls in general, like, there's going to be people that want to get them. Oh yeah, Dark Souls is so popular. Like, I still don't have any means of getting the Bloodborne um, PlayStation thing, the PlayStation equivalent of the Amiibo, because yeah. that's sold out in like minutes, oh, I, I and it. It, it's never gone back up. I've never that seen it in store. It's ridiculous. As hardcore as the fan base is, yeah, it's yeah not something that's gonna be easily found. No, and I I want it. But I'll never get I'll just end up, if I want something Bloodborne, I'll buy a Bloodborne statue, like one of the fancy ones, because I'd end up paying the same price for a fancy statue as I would for that damn amiibo from some second-hand seller. Yeah, this is true. So I might as well get, like, a 12-inch legit hunter statue. Yeah. But, no, I would love it if they did more Dark Souls amiibos. I would love to get, like, a... Uh, a Sif the Great Wolf, or like an Artorius. That'd be awesome. Yeah. That would be really cool, actually. Yep. Maybe get a, uh... You know, get a much bigger one going with like a Calamite or something. Ooh, yeah, that would be cool. Get yourself a full-fledged dragon. I would like it. Honestly, I think it would be cool if they would license um, Dark Souls Pops. Because they have the one for Dark Souls 3. They have the um, 
the final boss of the game. They have him as, as an amiibo, or not an amiibo, as a pop. But I would love it if they did the rest, because the cool thing about Dark Souls is none of, you don't really see the character's eyes, so it's not going to have like the pop, black, soulless eyes that a lot have. Yeah, it's not like the faces are the strength of Dark Souls. Yeah. I mean, that's why I collect so many of the Spider-Man pops, because really... The Spider-Man mask you can't do with those little dots. It's actually like eyes that they have to cr carve out. It's pretty cool. I have the Crash Bandicoot, but he has the black eyes, and it's his is pretty cool. But no, it, they, they could easily do like a 12... Not a 12-inch, that wouldn't sell, but a 6-inch Calamite pop. That would be great. Or even like a 6-inch Dark Eater. Dark Lurker? Yeah. Dark Eater. Dark Eater. The dragon. Mildred. Mildred? Yeah. That, uh, no. Uh, Madeir. Madeir. Who the fuck is Mildred? Yeah. <laughs> uh, Mildred is... Oh, crap. Almost walked off a ledge. Uh, Mildred is the half-naked woman that runs around with, like, the big-ass butcher knife. Yes. Man-eater Mildred, or Mildred, yes. You are correct. The yeah. one that finds you in Blight Town. Yep. And then... Pretty sh yeah, she's in Dark Souls 3 as well. I think she's in think all she three. In yeah, I yeah. think she's in all three. I think her, Ooh. Kirk. I know Kirk is in all three. Yeah, Kirk with his annoying self. Um, I think Richter is in all three. The the uh, rapier guy. Yeah, the rapier. I was like, I think some of them kind of are. Even if they might have a different name in two, like... Like, obviously you have the, uh... You have a Havel in all three games, even if they're not named Havel. Yeah, wasn't Havel... Oh no, Havel in three was the one where he was, like, stupidly well hidden. Yeah. Which we're gonna um... do... If this goes well, I would like to do the co-op in the other games. That would be pretty yeah, good. Yeah, I'd be down. It just is a question of, do we do all of the bosses or what? Because, like, Dark Souls 1, all bosses isn't hard to do. Dark Souls 2, with the Dark Lurker, would be a pain in the ass. Yeah. Well, like no, Dark Souls 2 we couldn't do only... Dark Lurker because you can't co-op him. He's solo. Mm, we'll see. Eh, it'd be fine if we can't do just him. Yeah, we could do literally every other boss in 2 except for Dark yeah. Lurker. Which is fine. I hate Dark Lurker. I have the trophy on PS3. I have beaten him in the past. I don't need to beat him again. <laughs> yeah. Uh... No. It's definitely not available from the guy at the perk. No? Do you start off with it? Nope. No, because I don't have it. Absolutely. Yeah, because he has the one that lets you write messages. So we're... I don't... Oh, that's right. You get it from uh, you get it from Solaire. Oh, yeah. All right, well, good luck, David. You got to beat the Taurus Demon. Yep. Because then you can come help me you... beat the Taurus Demon. <laughs> yep. I forgot they make you go that far. Uh... Oh, they start me off with a shield. I didn't even know that. Or I might have picked uh, it yeah, up. Yeah, pretty much. But either way, I got a shield. It's fine. Yeah, pretty much every class except for... Actually, no, I think every class in this game starts with a shield. Does it? I don't remember. I think... Oh I god, think rolled so. the wrong way. Fuck. Yeah, Star they... Souls 2 was they started to uh, be a little more evil about that. <laughs> Um, shit, do I tell him yes or no? Uh, I mean, you always tell yes. him yes. Make him happy before he dies. I forgot that I might have not wanted to skip all of his dialogue. Um, whatever. I killed him. Yeah, I mean, either way, you get what you need from him. Yeah, this Sir Reginald is a butthole, so. Uh, stupid Reggie. 
he he learned the best <laughs> this is like his the mort version of sir reggie yeah after he's served more way too long and been corrupted and it's gonna be my character's duty to try to bring him back to the light is he still alive oh my god how are you still now you're dead oh crap oh crap so I don't even have a catalyst Ooh. yet. Yeah, I don't have a. Uh, I still don't have a uh, talisman. I'm... Oh no! I just got my catalyst. Never mind. Where'd you get yours? Um, it was near where you find the drop-down point to the asylum demon. Hmm. Typically, there's like a bow and arrow there uh, if you're like a warrior. But for me, it was a um, catalyst. Please don't tell me I like completely ran past it. You may have. Well, huh. I mean, I guess I was in a hurry, but apparently I was in too much of a hurry. And I was like, I was pretty sure they should have gave me one in that uh, tutorial because it's supposed to be one of the starting items for the class. Well, crap. Well. I've now got a dagger and a wooden stick, so... Woo! You are loaded and ready to go. Not really, because I am not a patient fighter. And the sorcerer in this, you must very much be patient. <laughs> yeah... I'm also going to have to learn dodge rolling a lot more, because I have my shield put away. I guess I could pull it back out real quick. That's the one good thing about being the non-tanky build. It forces you to have to move. Yeah, it Which prepares you for Bloodborne. Later. Yeah. Which we Bloodborne could do every boss in Bloodborne, where... and we could do every boss in Dark Souls 3, too. It's just literally Dark Lurker we yeah. can do. Yep, it's, it's fine. It's the special little boss, anyway. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna saddle this that guy. And it's missed. The amount, of me it's the amount of mediocre bosses in Dark Souls 2, it's, it's it's fine to avoid one. <laughs> if you two-hand your wooden stick, does it do more damage? I feel like it does. But don't quote me on that. We're gonna put the stick there. Oh. I did get the talisman. I'm not sure when, but apparently I did. <laughs> Probably okay, at that I time you might have just thought it was the bow and arrow. Maybe. I feel better about myself now. Well, that I dagger did a no little bit I... of damage. No way, I ran right past it. <laughs> is good. Now I can use healing magic. Well, the nice part about being a sorcerer is I'm super far away from the asylum demon. Yeah. They definitely make certain fights. Quite a bit of fights. There's only certain ones that are a pain. Yeah, I just um, killed him very quickly. Yeah. I had to get up close and personal and mace him in the crotch. I mean, sometimes you just gotta mace a man in the crotch. I mean, it's an effective way to take them down. Oh god, that's a cliff. Right. I almost walked off the cliff. I was paying attention. All right. That's fine, I walked off the cliff too. Or more, like, rolled backwards off the cliff. I remember there's items over here, but they're not worth getting. They're like poppable souls. We're going to have so many souls from helping each other. It's going to be ridiculous. Yeah. Oh, the souls. I mean, we really will, because I'll get all the souls from my time killing the boss, and then I'll get the souls from you killing the boss. Yeah. We'll definitely uh, be rolling in the dope. So, like, unless we die, which, you know, is always possible. Yeah. I mean, once I stop rushing so much, it should be better. 
Um, in fact, I have two deaths right now. It's kind of not sitting well with me. Um, granted, one of them was because I pressed the wrong button to jump. Oh, well, speaking of amiibos, I, um, today, well, last night I pre ordered the King K. Rule amiibo from Donkey Kong Country, um, which. That's one of the games we have to have you sit down and play sometime. But I also pre-ordered today the Loot Goblin Amiibo for Diablo 3. Nice. That's yes, good old Loot Goblins. Yep. Well, I'm going to go ahead and level up while I wait for you. Uh, I'm pretty much just going to dump all of my levels straight into Intelligence first. Pretty much. Obviously, make sure you put some in attunement when the time comes so you can equip more magics. Currently, I have three attunement slots, so we're okay. Yeah, I was like, you start off with a little bit more as a sorcerer. Yeah, and I'm gonna have, have to, to really find... do attunement, uh, intelligence, and probably vitality and endurance, and that'll probably just be the whole build. Yeah, because it's a little different in one, because I know, like, two, you want to do, it's either two or three, one of them you want to do, like, dex, because it helps your sp speed of casting. Yeah, I don't remember which one that is. I don't think it's in one. No, I'm pretty sure it's two, because they just made everything different. Um... But yeah, one, I think it's pretty straightforward. Um, resistance might be good to get later on. Maybe. Yeah, something we'll see when we start getting the souls. But I'm going to have to save the Wizard Apprentice, and I'm going to have to save Big Hat Logan. Yes. And I'll have to get the. Well, what do we have here? I guess the cleric quest are the ones in the. Uh... They're the the one with the the. The graves. The white priest lady, the lady of white. Yeah the. Um, yeah the ones that go into the crypts. Yeah, so you're gonna have to save her, um, from her two buddies. You're gonna have to do a bit for her. Her quest is is longer than some of the others. Although Big Hat Logan, you have to save him twice too, because you have to save him from the um, the uh, the Duke's archives. Yep. Like you have to save him at Sens and then from the Duke's archives. Yeah, because he just doesn't know how to not get captured. Ooh. Ooh. Right. Tried to parry, failed it. Come on. Oops. Yeah, it's, it's only been a little while since I've uh, played. Only a little bit? Just just a little bit. Uh, yeah, I'm not going down that way just yet. You can, you can stay where you are at night. I'm on a quest to get this uh, soapstone. Hmm. Well, I'm just here waiting with uh, my good friend, the Crescent Knight. Uh, Crestfallen. Yeah, that guy. Yeah, Mr. Mopey. I'm just waiting here till Ooh. you get back with that soapstone so I can summon you. What? Oh, that was messed up, Crystal Lizard. It, like, played dead on me. I thought it was dead. And then it got up and started running again. Thankfully, I threw off its trajectory, so it couldn't disappear. Well, I'm walking into the uh, arena now for good old Taurus Demon. Nice, so you'll be getting back to me pretty soon. Yeah, hopefully. I'm trying to get used to the swing of this mace. Quite a bit more... Uh, yeah, that's that's one of the things you always have to learn in Dark Souls is the like attack movements and everything. Yeah, I guess 
the speed's pretty similar to the battle axe, so it's just kind of that long wind up. Right. If you miss. Is there anything else I can do while I wait for you here? Why, hello, tourist demon. I can technically try to go fight some skellingtons. That's always fun. Well, not really fight them so much as, like, run around and steal all their items. Yeah, the good old suicide runs. I know there's an item over here, isn't there? I thought there was. Ooh, ooh. There it is. Soul of the Lost Undead. Alright, suicide okay, run. Better. I was like, I don't do a lot of damage to this guy. A little bit better when I two-hand. Crap, 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 crap. See all the people who get lucky and have them like jump off. Like just once, I'd like to get that to actually work for me. Yeah, no, that's definitely not gonna happen for me. I'm probably gonna die because I'm picking up items I don't even need. I just got this Vihander. I'm like, when in the fuck am I gonna wield <laughs> this Vihander? Maybe you crap, crap, be crap, a crap, crap. barbarian. Oh no! Uh... Oh no! Oh no! No! Oh god! Run! Oh! Dodrill! <laughs> Serpentine! I didn't die. Well, there you go. Surprisingly. And... dead. You are the Taurus demon. I should have been more specific. Uh, I killed it. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah, in Dark Souls, yeah. it's, it's good to be a little more specific than that. Yeah, sorry. Defeated. <laughs> Again, you are the demon. <laughs> <laughs> I also got his freaking great axe, because that's going to come in handy for me. As a Let's cleric see, build? Only... I don't know. Not really. Only need 46, only need 46 strength to wield it. Sure, I'm, I'm sure that'll happen. Yeah, that'll, that'll definitely happen as a cleric. You're going to be a beefy cleric. Yeah. You're those gauntlets <laughs> of ogre kind. Yep, that cleric who can actually cast miracles. So, let me go ahead and maybe use one of these humanities so I can reverse my hollowing. Because I have to be human to summon you. <laughs> Heather messaged me. Apparently, Ooh. Oliver... Try to break into pork rinds, tortilla chips, and Oreos for the party tomorrow night. And he got really offended because she sprayed him, apparently, like, trying to hit him in the back and got him, like, right around the tail. And he was very offended. Ooh. Yeah. I mean, if he didn't, uh, try to put his face in everything. I mean, if he didn't eat pork rinds. Yep. That's a lesson he apparently will never try to learn. Okay. He might learn it now eventually. Let me let me run all the way back. Now in this didn't they make it so there was password summoning? Yeah, they pretty much all the stuff that they have in Dark Souls 3's online they put into this. All right, well, I'm going to give you the password for today so that no one random, uh, yeah, <laughs> can try to, can try to summon in, join in in the future. It'll be just the two of us, you and I. Just the two of us. We can make it if we try, just the two of us. We're gonna die. Yep. Yep. I'm making my way back. Making my way back. Well, the password for today is Goober. Capital G. Goober. Lowercase O-O-B-E-R. Goober. I approve. Because in the end, we're all just a bunch of Goobers. In the end, we're just a bunch of dust 
space dust. That, 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 that too. I forgot all you guys were back. Oh, Hi. the skeletons on the bridge. Uh, yeah, just all the guys you have to run through to get back towards the entrance. Ow! Don't you throw a fireball oh, what armor in my is that? Face? I don't remember that armor. Looking at some of the ghosts that pop up near the bonfire, and there was this set of blue I armor I don't recall from the game. There's but they were somebody who has like that really cool armor, and it's like, where did you get that? I want that. It looked pretty cool for a magic user. Yeah. You know, because I'm not going to be able to put on big, heavy armor like I normally do. Nope. <laughs> not unless you don't want to move. Uh, and I like moving. Moving is nice. It you know, is. being able to serpentine and hide and not die. It's wonderful. Yeah, it comes, it comes in handy. Don't try to team up on me. Alright. Well. Almost. Almost back. Chica chica. Day bow bow. Question is can you actually summon anybody in Firelink? Uh, I think you can if I walk slightly outside of it, but I think you can summon people in Firelink. I don't know. I guess we'll about the fun. If you want, I can make out. my way into the beginning of the Undead Burg. Well, I'm in Firelink now, so we'll at least give it a shot and see so that we know for future reference. Because uh, you can lay messages down, so I don't see why you couldn't summon in Firelink. Because I feel like Firelink is specifically connected to a, one of the bosses. But I don't know which one. Oh, that's the armor. I think yeah. that's like a dragon armor? I don't... I don't know. I'll have to show you that armor um, when the video goes doesn't, up. There's not much... It doesn't really matter too much with the levels right now, right? No, I don't think so. I think the password lets us ignore the level restriction. That's true. I forgot about that. I was like, either way, it's not like I'd be too far ahead of you. I'm level right, 6. Um, so, I'll be level 10, so yeah, it's only 4 point difference. Alright, I'm gonna try to... You wanna put it by the Crestfallen? Uh, I tried to put it at the stairs, but it wouldn't let me do that. Uh, you wanna put it by the tree by the stairs? That lead up towards the undead berg. Uh, hold on. Let's see. If we need, I could just go to the undead berg and summon you from there. Yeah, I think you might actually have to be in a. Okay, I'm going up there. Yeah, it's not. Yeah, it's not letting me put it down anywhere around here. So, I guess it makes sense since it's kind of the hub of the world. Alright, well I'm I'm making my way. Luckily these soul soul arrows are pretty strong against regular undead. Yeah. It really makes that starting uh run so much easier to be able to just stand back and uh last away. Oh, he almost fell off to his death. Now he's dead. I can't do that. Oh crap, almost rolled off. I can heal more though, so... Yeah, I can't do that. Yeah, I get... I've got the five extra heals on top of the Estus Flask. Oh, nice. Yeah, I do have those. Oh, well, I meant I have the five extra Estus from the Firelink bonfire. Because somebody yeah, kindled no, it. no, I got the... Yeah, I got the Estus, but then I also have the Heal Miracle. Right, the so Heal Miracle. Gives me another, yeah, which gives me another five uses. Alright, okay, well, yeah. I am back in the Undead Berg. I just killed... Oh, I just... Yep. 
Yep, just so killed the two just... the two guys. Oh god, definitely there's a third. Just can't be a uh, fire link. All right, so I will put it basically at the top of the stairs when you first leave the little sewer tunnel. Okay. Uh. Ooh, wait. I am here and I am waiting. Uh, I forgot. Completely forgot to do something. You forgot to put the password in? Yep. Well, now fucking, like, Narwhal Dick is gonna summon you. Because this is PlayStation. They don't give a shit what you name yourself. I actually did play with a, wall, a Narwhal penis one time. That sounds wrong out of context. <laughs> I played with a person whose gamer tag was Narwhal Penis. Or Narwhal Dick. Yeah. <laughs> I have not actually touched a Narwhal Penis. That is not uh, my milieu. It's not my uh, wheelhouse. Uh, got the password in. I'm hoping this works, because I've never done this before. That's a lie. I d oh, I think I see your ghost. Are you a woman? Yep. Okay, well, I see your ghost, but I don't see your summon sign. Uh, here, let me... Let me place a different one and see if that'll work. Because the one time we did... Oh, there you are. Anja, is that you? Yep. Cool. Yeah, the one time we uh, we did this in Dark Souls 3, it was pretty simple, because I was just in the woods at, like, a random bonfire. This is, like, trying to do this at the very start of the game. Yeah. I am being summoned. Yeah. Now, now that I've summoned you, I can't sit at a fire, right? Like a bonfire? I believe so, yeah, because that'll send me away. I bow. I would if I remember what button it is to do that. Oh, there it is. Well, I'm going to have to use my dagger then, because I only have 16 soul arrows, and I kind of want to save those for the Taurus Demon, so... Do you want to rest and resummon me? <laughs> no, I mean, we could always do that when we get to the next bonfire. Yeah. But that's good. We can push, still have, push through. Yeah. I still have all my heals, so I trust us to not be oh. completely obliterated by the, the Taurus demon. Yeah, this part's easy enough to really get through. <laughs> Alright. Gonna see the Hellfire Drake. Oh no! Oh god! Yo, Reggie, bro. Yeah, Reggie, bro. Oh, shit. Reggie, bro's getting fucked up. <laughs> Stop shooting, Reggie. Come here, Archer. I have the master key, so I can open any door I want. Whoa! You can get the shield I got. Yeah. Shield bros! Shield twins! Shield bros! Alright. These are the guys that kill me all the time. Just gotta learn to kick. I am horrible at kicking. Just forward and R1, like, um, basically at the same time. Just... Oops. Right when I... Oh, it still broke his guard. Oh, like, right when I go to show you, and then, of course, it doesn't actually kick that time. I wonder if I could use a spear. Probably don't have the stats for a spear. But your dex. Oh no, it's the strength. I got the dex. Oh yeah, I was strength say, is I an think eleven. It might be like a, yeah, it's a little bit of both. Can you actually see what else I have? Yeah, I, I don't have anything them. usable. Maybe I can buy something from this guy down here. Maybe. Ooh, there's a metal shield, but that'll definitely. Oh encumbrance me 
Yeah, gotta take this uh, cross. Nope, not the talisman. Take off the crossbow. <laughs> Alright. That's better. Um, well, I don't need the orange thing. I don't need the residence key because I have all the keys. Yeah, I always definitely get the repair box. What is my dex? I don't even know what my dex is. I didn't even look Probably at that. Uh, my oh, dex is turn. an 11. Okay. Wait, what is it? Is my strength a 5? Wow. So no, it's a 9. Now. Okay, it's a 9. Okay. <laughs> if I put two levels into strength, I could technically use the spear. Yeah. Because it's an 11 and a 10, and I have a, an 11 dex. I mean, it wouldn't get stronger over time unless I enchanted the spear, but a spear is not a bad weapon. Yeah, that's what I spent with my attempted cleric build in Dark Souls 3. There's certain enemies it's pretty crappy against, but I might overall, just do a short sword. Short sword's not a bad way to go. Nah. Gives you a lot more strength than that dagger, but it's still not something that's gonna slow you down. Yep. Or require a bunch of crazy strength. <laughs> Alright. Right. Well, now I at least have a decent weapon to fight the Taurus demon with. Other yeah. than my spears. Which is good. It's always good to have that extra weapon. Yep. Soul farming. Yeah. There used to be a skip where if you climbed this ladder, you could take a running angle from the top of it and essentially you could try to jump over that wall directly in front of you because you see the red mark like you see like the house and the street down there mm -hmm. that's where the uh, the wizard is held and everything where the burning dogs are yeah on the way to mm -hmm. good old capra demon so if you yep so if you aimed your jump just right you could land on it and roll off and skip everything up to that point of the game The things that people learn. I know. I'm always impressed watching all the ways people do it. And make it look so easy. Yeah, people are fucking crazy. I was about to say, is there nothing up here? I don't remember. Yeah, there should be a crossbow around the corner. Not that I can really use it. Other than that, I think that's it. I did forget to do this. Oh, yeah. The, uh... Ragdoll! I don't even remember what's fully over here. I don't either, even though I did this before I went to Toys Demon. Oh, it's rubbish. That's right. <laughs> it's a yeah, trap! That's right. It's just a wasted trip. Behind you. Oh, he's still alive. I saved you. <laughs> well, My I shield you. blocked that for you. I appreciate it. Um, uh, but... I started to carry, started to carry his ragdoll corpse up the ladder with me. I think the item that you come up here for is really this one. The humanity. Hmm. Ah, that's right. And then you roll this. Like way. I know there was something, just obviously not anything spectacular. Though humanity's good. Yep. All right. Oh look, I just fucking found a short sword drop. Oh. 
I wasted 600 souls on that. Don't you just love it? Yeah, I can't even access the bonfire while you're here, so. Yeah. Like, I can't get in the room. I guess we, sh I guess we should have had you sit at the bonfire first. Nah, it's alright. We'll make it. Because I'm yeah, using a short can, sword, I'll have plenty of spells when we get there. Yeah. But yeah, even that doorway is fogged off, so yeah, can't even go to the other area. Nope. We can get to the Taurus Demon. Uh, yep. Which is fine. Ow. This <laughs> is so dramatic from this angle. Here. Uh, come here. Stand next to me. Oh, it, it only healed me? I it was probably too far away. Unless it's a specific spell. It might be a specific spell that you need in Dark Souls 1. Yeah, let me actually look at the, uh... What it says. Uh... Ow. Ow. It actually doesn't specify. Oh god. Oh god. I'm coming. I'm I fine. was I'm leading. Right. I'm alright. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, you're like on fire. That's one of those worst moments where it's like you stop to do something and then you see Summoner murdered. Returning to world. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. Hi, oops. My bad. Got a little distracted. It's that moment when the uh, the Alfred gif from The Dark Knight Rises is, pro is pertinent. You trusted me and I failed you. <laughs> Got a lot of souls, which is nice. Yeah, they add up pretty quick at these uh, low levels. I'll watch your back, because when I went up there, the shield guy tried to come up after me. Now I will say, I want to pop all of my humanity and uh, tag team that Dark Knight, that Black Knight, before we uh, do Taurus. <laughs> because I want to yeah. try to get a good drop. Even though, as a sorcerer, I have no way to use it. <laughs> yep. Maybe the shield? I'm not entirely sure. I was hoping you were going to flank them. Yeah, I uh, realized my mistake when I jumped down. But I could do this. Easy enough to get around them. Ow, oh, stop blocking. You know, ever since I told you how easy it is to kick, I have not been able to- there we go. Have not been able to kick. <laughs> Alright. I feel like that's- Well, I've got one soft humanity. Should I just- Because, yeah, none of the armor and, like, the shield, maybe. I don't even think I'll have the strength to wield the shield. Yeah. The shield would probably be the only thing useful. Maybe the pants? Or the gloves. Yeah. The gloves would probably like be the, not bad. The sword, yeah, you're definitely not getting that. Or wheeling it. Uh, I only have four humanity. Also... Fuck it, we'll just we'll just kill him and see what happens. Alright, hold on, I'm gonna try this. I've also never seen him just Oh, you've never seen him in his natural state? No, he always just stands perfectly still for me. Until I get right up on top of him and then Oh wow. You actually got him. Nice. Yeah. If you take, like, little steps... Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. Uh, you really went the wrong way. I was hoping you would butt-stab him, David. <laughs> it didn't quite work. <laughs> Should we, uh, lead him up the stairs to where there's more room to circle? Yeah, yeah. That would be good. And that way if... That way if you... Ah! Run. Run, damn you. That way if you die, you don't have to go all the way, uh... Crap, I'm gonna die. I rolled off the stairs. <laughs> okay. That'll be the distraction. Oh god. Oh wow, that, that did a lot of damage. Luckily it didn't kill me. Oh crap. Hey, get back here. That works. Yep. I'm really glad he stammered there when he fell. Oh, 
All right, Ooh. he's dead. Did he drop anything? Just a Titanite junk. Still, he's dead. <laughs> yeah, let's go get that. Uh, I think it's the blue dragon ring. Something. It's the blue dragon or no? It's the blue tear stone ring. It's the one that ups your defense That's right. when your health is low, which, as a sorcerer, will be very helpful. Yeah. Now, the blue dragon ring would be great as a sorcerer, because that's an act I'll actually get to use the magic rings for once. Yep, the ones that give you extra attunement and increase your uh, intelligence. Or... Run away! All right. Dude. We got to try to kill the crystal lizard up here too. Yes. Did he is did he get away from you? No, I managed to get him cuz I kind of uh next one up. Oh. Well, fuck these barrels anyway. Yeah. I mean, no barrels left unturned. Uh, well here. I'll stay down here in case he starts running this way, which he's Since likely to do. Any day. Yeah, it's what he aims. Oh. I was like, never mind. You landed right on him. Uh, but two, yeah, I like two twinkling titties. I deflected his deflected his course to where he got stuck up here and couldn't run away. Ah, uh, all right. So, yeah, kind of kind of worked out. All right. Well, we need to kill. The, I'm gonna kill those two soldiers on the top of the thing first, so that they're not sniping us while you yeah. summon your way in. And then, if you want to lead him over this way, I'll plunge onto his skull. Sounds good. Really, if you're telling it right, it might be a double plunge. If you wait a sec, like, especially if it takes him a little while, I should be able to get up the ladder. So I have to you plunge, maybe I can plunge. Okay, yeah, we can give it a shot. My character will run. I'm beginning to think it's just the online right now on uh, Dark Souls. It might be. It could be my mom's internet. As long as it doesn't drop, though, we're good. Because this moment she's hesitating to run. Also, why is he not jumping down? Oh, Move all the way over. He here. doesn't. I don't think he drops for you. He has to drop for me. I think. Okay, so we'll do the same plan, but we'll reverse it. Roll I'll reversal. Go up there and wait for you to lead. I was like, I'm practically to this other tower. Why is he not? Uh... Yeah. So you go ahead and get up there, and I'll. Uh... Yes. Oh, you ragged all the guy up with you, at least halfway. Woo! All One right. day I'll get him up the ladder. Because, yeah, I think he's Alex. activated yep, from me, yep. not you. So much more fun seeing him jump from this angle. Does he actually jump off? I, he always just looked like he appeared out of thin air to me. Uh, basically. Is he close enough? Yeah, got him. Alright, and now once you're off... See if you can distract him. I'm going to try to do it again. Because I have was... very limited uh, soul arrows. I have four. No, five. All right, and... Well, that did a little bit, bit of damage. All right, that's my last soul arrow. But he's almost dead. Dead. Yeah. Woo. Good old double team. Yeah. All right. Bye, Anja. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> I was like, man, I disappeared quick. So I'm gonna go get the uh, thing from Solaire, and then you can summon me into your world, and we'll do yours first, and then we'll do mine second, and we'll just go in that right. pattern back and forth uh, till the end of the game. Works for me. Gives me time to run all the way back over there. Oh, yeah, that's true. Yeah, that's the one part that's going to suck about this at certain parts. Yeah. Since there's uh, not the... Uh... <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, how are you going to get to me in, like, Blight Town? Uh... Figure it out. <laughs> we might just have to go comes. down Blight Town at the same time and meet at the bonfire down by like Quelag's domain. 
Might have two. Otherwise, it's like, okay, let's go through Blight Town. Okay, now you gotta climb all the way back up Blight Town. Yeah. No, that would suck. It'll be easy in the second half of the game once we get the ability to teleport. But yeah, Blight yeah. Town is definitely gonna be. And even then, it's still a little more limited than, uh. <laughs> oh, David. What? I wanna do something completely Mort related. Uh oh. I want you to help me murder Solaire. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're gonna murder Solaire. I've never murdered him, so... Oh, you get his clothes and everything. Yeah, I just... I always look at him and I'm like, I can't kill you. You're my friend, son, bro. Bastard. Yeah. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a your... dirty bastard for killing him. Oof, that was close. Because I have... The last bonfire I was at was Firelink, so if I die... Yeah. Like, you should probably... Well, no, because then you'd have to run back. Well, I'm, I'm kicking the ladder down to activate the one. Because of the shortcut. Uh, I completely forgot about that. Yep. I'm an idiot. <laughs> Alright, level up. Uh, Alright, I'm gonna up my spells. I was like, I need to, 20. to get. Need to get back to that other bonfire. Let me run all the way. I forgot all I had to do was run past the freaking dragon. Uh, I'll remember Dark Souls sometime. Alright, so I've got my, so my health and my endurance to level 10, and my intelligence is at 21. It should be pretty good. Indeed. Because endurance will help with helps with um, carrying capacity, doesn't it? Uh. Yes, it does. Yes. Uh, in this one, yes, because this is uh, before they separated it. Yeah. It's also the one where you don't have a percentage bar, so it's completely confusing. Yeah. Because you have to actually do the math. Because while I want to kill Solaire, I could get his straight sword, which would be cool. That would be a good weapon to use. Um, do you want to meet me underneath the bridge, like where you would hit the drake's tail? Uh, sure. That's fine. And then from there we can run up and go kill Solaire. Run, Andrew, run! Ah, almost got to it without getting burned. It's kind of unfair, I was like halfway down the stairs. Uh, but yep, I am just gonna hit this bonfire real quick. Go for it, and then I can summon you and we can go kill Solaire. And I can try to get all his weapons and shit. Woo! And then we can swap it back to you. Yeah. Because I just wanna. So really. I just wanna get his stuff. No, really, if I'm summoned, it might be better to just go ahead and do it with yours. Whatever. It's good either way. Um, since I'll already be in, and that'll be like, you know, you gotta go uh, kill a boss now. Yeah. Okay, so... I will do it... Yeah, I'll do it right out, right at the, right inside the doorway that leads to where you would shoot at the uh, tail. Okay. And for the sake of my own knowledge, this is where I'm gonna end the video for YouTube. So hi, right, bye guys. All right, bye bye. Come back bye. next time to see us kill Solaire. Goodbye. Woo.